Hi, my name's Tom. Welcome to Quick Leaks Weekly, and in this lesson, we're going to be looking at an alternate picking exercise straight out of John Petrucci's vocabulary. Here it is up to speed. <laughs> Now, any of you familiar with John Petrucci's Rock Discipline DVD will recognise uh, this lick or something similar to it. It's something I picked up very, very early on from my very first guitar teacher, uh, and it's a fantastic way to practice your alternate picking. Now, you might have noticed in that clip I favour starting with an upstroke. Um, this lick will work whether you lead with a downstroke or an upstroke, but it's really good to practice both, uh, something I don't do. Um, let me break it down for you. So. We're going to start off barring on the G and D string with our first finger at the 7th fret. Now everything uh, is double picked and by that I mean that we play each note twice. So instead of going we go like that. So we start off and what we're doing is we're pedaling a note on the D string. So we've got this first finger, we've flattened our finger so we're playing with a pad of the finger on the 7th fret of the D and the G and we double pick the G string at 7th fret and then the D at 7th and then back to the G at 9th, back to the D at 7th, then 10th on the G, 7th on the D again, then 9th on the G and back to the 7th on the D. So that pattern slowly is and basically we repeat that pattern three times but changing the note on the D string so it changes from the seventh fret which we play with our first finger because we've got that pad at the start the eighth fret which we play with our middle finger and then ninth fret which we play with our ring finger so that section slowly sounds like this So that lick ends with us moving up to the 9th fret on the G, 10th fret on the D, 12th fret on the G, 10th uh, fret on the D, 9th fret on the G, 11th fret on the D, and then holding a note on the G string at the 12th fret. Now this isn't where the full lick ends, um, I'm not sure if it's exactly the same as the original, I've probably misremembered it, but this is what I used to practice. So that last section sounds like this slowly. And like I said before, this lick is fantastic to practice your alternate picking, whether you're starting with a downstroke or starting with an upstroke, it's really good for that. It's something I should probably work on with my, uh, my leading with a downstroke, because I always lead with an up. Uh, here's the whole thing slowly. And here it is up to speed. <laughs> Now I'm sure you can find a way to use this lick in your playing uh, and if it doesn't really fit into your solos or improvisations then it's a fantastic way to warm up. I hope you've enjoyed this lesson and I'll see you soon.